What up, Hope Biscuits? It's your girl Skitten back at it again. And before you comment on it, yes, I broke a nail. Yes, I broke a nail. Uh, I actually, <laughs> I actually broke it the first, like the day I got them done, I broke it. Um, and then, but I was able to like glue it back. And then I have, I was scheduled to get it fixed the next week. And then that is when I got COVID. So it's just been broke ever since. Um, I had it glued on for a minute, but eventually it just like snapped off. And I was like, I don't even know where it is. I'm not gonna go looking for the part that broke off to try to glue it back on again. Like I'm not doing all of that. I have bigger things in my life to worry about. Uh, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are safe and sanitized. I'm doing pretty good. I have almost entirely recovered from my bout with COVID thankfully um it was rough though i was even after i was over the worst of the symptoms um the fatigue was absolutely incredible um and then just like the lingering um shortness of breath just like crazy coughing fits um i, I had it for like a not a full week probably like four or five days um i was unable to keep down a lot of food it was i was a mess it was a mess it was honestly awful it's i was gonna say i wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy but i'm mean so i, I would wish it on my worst enemy <laughs> but uh it is not something that i recommend it's definitely a zero out of ten would not do again but also the Johnson & Johnson vaccine is whack as fuck. Uh, I, if anybody from Johnson & Johnson is watching, y'all need to step your game up, okay? Because Charles and I had the Johnson & Johnson vaccine and we had horrendous, awful, horrible COVID symptoms for two weeks. Like, I'm, not, I'm now on two and a half weeks. Chavez is on like his 10th day. Um, and we had awful symptoms all the way up until probably like three or four days ago. Okay. Meanwhile, my dad, who is fully vaxxed, but he has Pfizer, he had the symptoms of a mild cold and was literally out riding his bike like the third day after he got sick. The disrespect, honestly and truly. Uh, so anyway, if you're not vaxxed yet, Go with Moderna or Pfizer. Johnson & Johnson ain't shit, like for real, for real. And if you already have uh, the Johnson & Johnson, if you are like us, one of the unlucky few, go ahead and get that Pfizer Moderna booster, baby. Like, go ahead and do that, cause this shit spread like no fucking joke. Anyways, today we are here to watch Kids Are Flippin' Stupid. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. This is the fastest thing in the world. <laughs> Opening these hands will have you questioning your own strength. Really though? Thinking about having kids. My son poured syrup in every floor vent. 13 years later it still smells like waffles every time the heat comes on. Why? Five year old asked why me to go find something do downstairs. I couldn't find it. Five year old. I've got an idea. This time go back downstairs and try your best. <laughs> My four-year-old keeps trying to fill up his mouth at the sprinklers and then run across the park to spit the water on me, but the very thought makes him laugh so hard that I remain perfectly dry. All of these are hilarious, but also the five-year-old being like, oh, this time go back downstairs and try your best. It's giving me very much like when parents are like, oh, well, where did you last see that thing that you lost? Like, obviously, mother, if I knew where the last place was that I saw it, I wouldn't be asking you for help. J j like, you know, that is the edit. Like he learned that from y'all. Y'all taught your five-year-old to be like that. We once gathered all four kids and asked to cut the strings on the blinds. None answered. Then I asked where are the scissors that did it. Number two son got up and produced them from the closet. Do you know how hard it I is not to laugh? Yourself, bro. When I grow up. When I grow up. When I grow up. Sorry, had a little pussycat dolls moment there. I also just realized I don't actually know those lyrics. Hold up, let me let me look those up because I fucked that up. Oh, I want to be famous. I want to be a star. I want to be in movies. Yeah, okay, I fucked it. I fucked it up. Be on TV, people know me. Be on magazines. 
grow up I want to be carried away by owls. Me too broskies. Parents on bus 23. A child gave my son his tablet in exchange for an Oreo cookie today on the bus. Please contact me for your tablet back. What? Accidentally read goodnight beans instead of goodnight bears in goodnight moon. And now my toddler is repeating goodnight beans like it's a group Human chat. Human beans! My mom got fired from her job when I was little and I cried because I thought that meant they were going to light her on fire. <laughs> my toddler who was not previously accustomed to being awake after dark, just looked outside and screamed where is the backyard. <laughs> Poor this baby. afternoon I noticed him sneakily grabbing some finishing nails so I followed him and caught him red handed. He told me he was setting a trap. Oh my god, for who? Tornadoes come from Jupiter. They come to Earth and swooped up humans. Then go back to Jupiter with their tornado friends. That would be terrifying, 5 actually. Drinking my own pee for views. I will respect you because you do 70% of what I need. Only 70. My son feeding his fake dog goldfish while his real dog sits outside pissed. <laughs> Incident today. Hello. Today Christina did something very peculiar. She was chewing on a pencil eraser. Not a big deal I asked her to spit it out. Then she said she wanted a cookie got down on the ground and started chewing on her desk leg. Then the lid of her desk. I asked her to get up and to please sit down on her seat. She proceeded to rip paper and chew on it then offer it to people in her group. What? I spoke with Christina and told her we don't put also, our mouths on anything and that we need to keep our masks on it. Why did you spell your baby's name like this? Why? Why did you name your child Christina? Like, you wanted to name her Crystal but your husband wanted to name her Christina so y'all were like, this is a good compromise. Like, no! Stop doing dumb shit like this. Why would, like, why? Why would you set your kid up for failure like this? This is fucked up. This is child abuse. This is child abuse. Government's over here worried about people wanting to name their kid Lucifer or Satan. Okay, you should be, you should be talking to the people who spell their name like this. This is who you should be talking to. In the classroom, I asked her why she was doing those things. She responded with, because I miss my mom. I told what her that if we miss our mom, we still don't put things in our mouths. Oh, shit, she said she can't be at school all day because she misses you and needs to be with you. If you could please speak with her and remind her how okay, important it is that we don't cute. put anything other than food in our mouths. Thank you for your help. I really okay, do appreciate it. Cute, I love my whole family. Christmas list. Gymnastics clothes. Gymnastics bar. Slime box. Robot helper to color. Okay. Coloring set. Okay. Fidget set. Yeah. Lava lamp. Yeah. Pajamas. Lava hoodies and jeans. Okay. T-shirts. Roblox gift cards. All right. Chocolate. Nine thousand pounds. Oh my god. Bath bombs. You know what? You know what? But if you don't ask, you don't receive. Okay. The squeaky wheel gets the grease. Is it oil? Whatever. Some sort of lubricant. The WD-40, if you will. Okay, so you know what? Good on you for asking, for being bold enough to ask, okay? Um, but also, he said Christmas list, and uh, it reminded me of uh, that Christmas song that talks about a Christmas list. I don't remember what it is right now, though, but it did remind me of that song. And then I almost started singing that Christmas shoe song, but that song is sad, and I don't want to bum you guys out. Chocolate, 9,000 pounds. Bath bombs. Four year old saw picture of me pregnant. I explained that she was inside me. She thought for a bit then said, I never want to do that again. Me Daddy, either, your dude. nose holes are huge. In the age four. I yelled big chungus in a Walmart. Oh, okay. For some reason when I was a little kid I was absolutely convinced that in the same way that bees produce honey wasps produce mustard. When I was a kid before I knew be anything about abuse. astrology my classmate asked me my sign. She said she was a cancer so I said I was leukemia. I still think about oh this conversation Lord, to this day. Mercy. Your family Which is Chinese but patient to this day. Up. Why child? What? Your family is Chinese but you've never had Panda Express. Do you have a crush on anyone? YouTube. He's speaking in Scribble. I think he was looking for the word gibberish. He's have a good day. I will never I have like a that. good day at school. Ooh, okay then. My wishes. 
First I wish that social studies was not a thing. I wish that school was only Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. I wish school wasn't always so hard. I wish I get all A's on my report card. I wish the government was smart. That sounds like it could be a dope ass rap song. That little girl got bars. What's her name? Isabella. With my three et all A's on my report. Isabel. Isabel. You should hit up Jay-Z. For real, for real. Hove Records. Report card. I wish the government was smart. Me too. With my three year old. Huh. Can I have a paper towel? Me. Why? You made a mess. Huh. No. Me. Can I come check? Huh. No mom. Only check when I'm done cleaning. <laughs> hey Siri where is mom? No 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 don't put that in your mouth. Give me that. Give me that. No no you give me that. I didn't get that. <laughs> Could you try again? Siri be like what's going Carved on? Carved a pumpkin. Decided to carve rocket ship. This morning before school I punched a boy in the face. He waved his fist in my face and I thought he was going to punch me. Like I talked to Mrs. Armstrong and I apologized. I missed my recess to write this that note. That sounds like self-defense. Life's a water slide you where you die at the end. That. Start. Oh. Oh. You are here. Oh. I called 911 when I was little 5 maybe because I was going on a picnic with my mom and I wanted to see if they wanted to come too. Cute. Oh, oh yes, in things said by my students during a science lesson. Miss I think Einstein's really stupid. Why? Well because we already know the stuff he found out, like we know it now. Yes child. You're Boys right. have much cooler toilets, in the age 6.4. <laughs> my sister was playing hide and seek with my little cousin. Where are you? Tim, I'm right here. The Matrix 4. The John Matrix. Wick. The Matrix. The, the Mattress. Keanu the Reeves. Mattress. Keanu Reeves movie. Keanu Reeves. Cute. Friday. Yes, we'll wash them. Thanks. Can you work with her on writing three letter words? All she wants to write is poop. <laughs> One time when I was a kid my mom was pregnant and she asked if I wanted a brother or a sister. A turtle. I promptly replied. Neither. Neither okay how? kids listen closely cause I'm only gonna say this 257,000 more times. Yeah. Moms. Kids be like, watch this, then run and do a little kick. Wasted my freaking time. <laughs> No, you gotta Has anyone else got any funny stories from when they were younger? Be me 10 years old. It's 2001 in the UK. Playing in the street with my good friends. The road is a hill and my house is near the top. Woman comes speeding down road so we all scatter and call her a beach. Damn. She lives halfway down the hill and parks at the side of the road. Gets out and calls us little shizzes etc and goes inside. One day I noticed some keys outside her house and because I'm a good boy I knock her door to give them back to her. She doesn't even open the door just tells us to frick off her property. Bitch. Get an idea. Wait until night time unlock her car and let off her handbrake. Car begins to roll downhill and we all run away. A car menace. picks up speed and goes straight into a house at bottom of the road. All she's our pants but go home and deny That's all knowledge. Up. Police come and arrest woman as she's really drunk and accuse her That's of leaving handbrake off. Never got That's in trouble for it really be up. nice to kids i mean yeah be watching nice to my kids, husband but climb also, the attic you're a criminal and an awful person though what you could have hurt the people in the house kids are stupid kids are just dumb as hell gladder six year old be careful daddy your feet are huge <laughs> fear well not really in the 60s a lot of things were harder for some people than others me really tell us more about how the 60s were fear fear well lots of things were different in the 60s it was hard to talk to people the internet wasn't invented in the 60s but it's different now i mean me wow well, this kid is really deep fear and also houses didn't even exist yet in the 60s God damn me it, and there it is God damn no it. climbing on sculpture punishable to fullest extent <laughs> okay but to be fair the kids are not to blame there that is a parent issue that is a parental unit problem right there this baby is having a grand old time ain't she children are unsuspecting me fullest extent Children are unsuspecting meat eaters. More than a third of children in the US aged 4 to 7 think cheese, bacon, hot dogs, chicken nuggets, shrimp, and hamburgers come from plants. According to a new study, nearly half of the children in this age group also think french fries come Why from do animals. They think that? 
What? A student of mine asked me if blonde hair was an ethnicity. I teach secondary school. They were 15. Counting my days at this damn job. <laughs> I remember one time when I was about 8 probably and I was eating cereal. And for some reason I grab a salt shaker and put some salt in my cereal. I eat some of it and go to my parents with a bowl. I tell them mom my cereal tastes weird and I hand her the bowl. She tries some and says did you put something in it or did it taste like that? I tell her that I put salt in it. She simply replied with well no wonder it tastes bad. You put salt in it. And I say oh. I thought you were trying my to prank My story of stupidity. Just stupid. When I was around for me and my mom was shopping at Home Depot and we passed a man who was working there. Who happened to be black. I apparently was not familiar with skin colors and asked my mom loudly, does he have his black face on, which embarrassed her to pieces. Luckily the guy what? had a sense of humor. My mom won't let what? me forget this. When I get bigger I'm gonna play the guitar like crazy, but I'm not gonna wear a bucket on my head. I'll write a song about pumpkin seeds. As you should. In the age 4.8. As you should. When I was 12 I did something to make a teacher mad so he assigned me a 500 word theme. I didn't know what a theme was so I wrote the word theme 500 times. I counted each word to be sure it met the requirements. What do they teach you in school that you don't know what a theme is? Like what? Hello? It's not even like they use the word motif. Theme is a very basic word. That makes me upset. That makes me upset. Not at you before the people teaching you because they are clearly failing y'all. But then again, we knew this already. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Uh, kids are great. Okay. Like, yes, they're dumb, but like, you know, they tell it like it is somehow, somehow, sometimes. Uh, and even when they're not telling it like it is, they're telling it the way they think it should be. And I support that. I fully support that. A lot of times that people forget that like kids are not just like, like people, other children, but like children are little people. They are people with personalities and thoughts and feelings. And I, I just always think it's really interesting and funny um, when they express those. So uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave your reaction requests and recommendations down in the comments below. And other than that, peace out, Hope Biscuits. It's Skittin' Lit.